first thing Lily did was prime her face using the Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair. Then she went in with the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer in the shade Light Sand 2 Spot Conceal, and she blended it in using the Eagle Tools Beauty Blender. That's good. She then used the Chanel Ultra Wear Flawless Foundation in the shade Beige. She then went back in with the same concealer to conceal her under eye, her cupid's bow, her T-zone, and her chin. She then baked her face using the Cody Airspun Loose Face Powder in the shade Naturally Neutral. This powder is very good if you have very oily skin. It locks all the oils into place. But if you do have very dry skin like I do, I wouldn't recommend it because it does tend to cling onto dry patches. She then just brushed that powder away using the Real Techniques sculpting brush. She then used the Wet n Wild Mega Glow Contouring Palette in the shade Dolce de Leche and she took the darker color on a Pixie Precision Foundation brush to contour her face. a little bit on a fluffy eyeshadow brush just to contour her nose. She then went with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Modern Renaissance palette and she took the shade Warm Taupe on a Morphe M504 brush and she buffed that into her crease. She then went in with the shade Cypress Umper on a Morphe M441 brush and she buffed that into her outer V and then up into the crease. Then she went in with Cypress Umper on a more dense brush and put it right on the outer V. Tempora on a very flat shader brush and she put it all over her lid. She then did a winged liner using the Anastasia Beverly Hills waterproof cream color in the shade Jet. the CoverGirl Hydro Proof Mascara in the shade Berry Black. <laughs> Lily then filled in her brows using the Benefit Cup Brow in the shade 3. Now as you can tell in this video, me and Lily are complete opposites. I have very dry skin while she has very oily skin. She also does her face before she does her eyes while I do my eyes before I do my face. so much for watching and watching my friend do her makeup tutorial. I will see you in my next video. Bye!